Senator Huey P. Long, storm center of Louisiana's hectic political scene, was shot in the state capitol at Baton Rouge in an attack on his life by Dr. Carl A. Weiss, Jr., a political opponent. The presence of armed guards could not prevent the attempted assassination, although Weiss was immediately afterwards riddled with bullets. Senator Long, whose Bayou dictatorship and political activities have made him a national figure, is lying at the point of death in a Baton Rouge hospital. His wife, however, is confident he will recover. His anti-administration battles have made many bitter enemies for him, but with his iron-handed sway over his own home state, his share of the wealth plan has attracted the attention and support of thousands of his fellow countrymen. An eyewitness to the death of Huey Long gives a vivid word picture of the shooting and the death of Carl Weiss, the assassin, under the guns of a dictator's bodyguard. Meanwhile, the murderer, who is mowed down by 61 slugs, has an immediate burial. As I opened the door of the governor's office, the sound of a shot came from the corridor outside. Senator Long staggered away, his right hand clasping his side. Two men struggling on the floor, one I recognized as Murphy Road and the highway policeman. He backed away from the other man, firing as he backed. Suddenly, a dozen more men began firing, and the hallway was filled with the sound of Voting fire. 